awesome morning. Hey, it's Friday the 10th of November, the day the government observes for, I guess, to give people day off like the mail and the banks and all that, Veterans Day, because Veterans Day is actually November 11th tomorrow, the 11th day of the 11th month at the 11th hour. That's also Armistice Day overseas. It's also Fasching starts in Germany. And if you don't know what that is, look it up. But anyway, for today, yeah, I know, I'm just full of history and a bunch of other stuff, according to Martin. Anyway, National Vanilla Cupcake Day. That's for all you little cupcakes out there. It's the Marine Corps birthday today, Semper Fi to my brothers from the other mother across the way, Uncle Sam's misguided children, we love you, we sent you crayons for your birthday, <laughs> and it's National Forget-Me-Not Day, Forget-Me-Not Flower, and Forget-Me-Not, for I have lived I will never live again. Since it's Red Friday, I thought I'd find this awesome, awesome quote for today. No greater love has a man than this, that he lay his life down for his friend. Said another way, Greater love has no one than this, that he lay his life down for his friend. <sighs> yeah, for those who don't know, that's from John fifteen thirteen, out of the Bible. But it's also true. I know today there's a movie called No Greater Love being distributed, made by a chaplain in the army about the Afghan war. And it's not so much about him or the war. It's all about the stories of the men in between, the ones that actually went and he was out there with them taking this film. This is a doc documentary, but it's their ins and outs of being deployed, trying to come back to the real world, staying out there, deciding to go back for second, third, fourth deployment because it was easier to live. Losing friends, losing buddies, losing limbs. Today and tomorrow, as we observe Veterans Day, think about that verse. No greater love as a man or woman that lay their life down for their friend. Think about it. Yeah, I've watched some of them women, they're just as crazy as some of the guys when it comes to defending the perimeter when they're out there, even though it's not their job. It's not what they're there for, at least not in the units I was with. They're protecting their buddies, their friends, their families. They're deployed. Got to realize nowadays they're volunteered for it. It's not like they were drafted and told they had to go somewhere. They volunteered for it. Maybe not volunteered to go to Afghanistan, but they volunteered for the military. It's an all volunteer force. They want to lay down their lives for their friends. None of us want to lose our lives, but we're willing to put it on the 
mind for our friends, our family, our country. So think about today, Red Friday, everyone, you know, remember everyone deployed Red Friday. Think about all those who are out there right now and all of those that didn't come home. As we say from Vietnam, all gave some, but some gave all. Hey, today's cigar, Rebellion Battalion. Yep. It's a full body, full kick butt, I would say 98, 99 on the uh, zero to 100 miles of full body has hints of spice that are just perfect has a little bit of a tea taste but not what I would consider overwhelming like some people think it is but it's a real smooth taste I'll tell you what it's one of the smoothest full body up there it's a Nicaraguan wrapper the binder is from Honduras and the filler is a combination of Honduras and Nicaraguan but it's actually made in Dominican Republic this one is a 6x44 and I can tell you it rivals any full body Monte Cristo I've ever had and I've had a few because yes I am a do like a, a good Monte Cristo every now and then. So I'm telling you, if you haven't tried it, get out and try. It's called Rebellion Battalion. They've got militia, they've got infantry. Get out there and try them. In the meantime, being Red Friday, you got to remember everyone deployed. Get out there, say thank you to our vets this weekend, and above all, smoke what you like, like what you smoke, and kick some ash. Fire done going out. Got it relit, Fred. <laughs> That's all, folks.